mismatch between a person's personality traits and his or her job requirements can lead to more than just a miserable employee. A new study has revealed that an employee whose personality traits match the traits that are ideal for his is or her job is more likely to earn a higher salary than an employee whose traits are less aligned. The findings question the idea that there is an ideal personality type and could change the way interviews are conducted. The research could have an impact on company hiring practices, as the researchers suggest both employees and employers should take a more nuanced approach to assessing both the individual's traits and job required traits. Our findings show that looking at the combination of personality traits and job demands is key to predict important outcomes, like income, says the lead researcher of the study Job J. Aidan Isson of Tilburg University. This updates the notion that you only have to look at the personality traits of an individual to predict his or her life outcomes. Our results indicate that it's more complex, you also have to take that person's environment into account. Findings from previous research indicated that some personality traits are generally beneficial in a work environment. For example, Denison says that being highly conscientious is associated with being hardworking, well-organized, and rule-abiding, qualities that tend to be valued in employees. But Denison and co-authors question the notion that there is an ideal personality type. They hypothesize that the match or mismatch between an individual's traits and job demands might be critical when it comes to important outcomes like income. The researchers examined the personality profiles, annual income and jobs of 8,458 people living in German, using data from the nationally representative German socio-economic panel. Because men were more likely than women to be employed full-time in Germany at the time of the data collection, the sample was 68% male and 32% female, with a mean age of 43.7 years old. Participants' jobs were classified using the International Labour Organization's International Standard Classification of Occupations. Then, two psychologists with extensive expertise in occupational issues, but who did not know about the researchers' hypotheses, then assessed each job for its ideal levels of Big Five traits. For example, they found that a bookkeeper required the lowest level of extroversion, whereas an actor or director required the highest level. The researchers then used a statistical technique called response surface analysis to create a 3D model that identified how each employee's personality traits and the ideal personality traits for each job contributed to employee income. The results showed that fit does matter, at least when it comes to extroversion, 
agreeableness, and openness to experience. For these three traits, a greater match between an employee's personality and job demands was linked with higher income, which the researchers call a fit bonus. The data also revealed that it's possible to have too much of a good thing, employees who are more agreeable, more conscientious, or more open to experiences than their jobs required actually earned less than people who had harmoniously matching levels of those traits. The model showed that, in some cases, having too little of a given trait was actually less costly than having too much. Personality characteristics that have long been thought of as universally adaptive were not very beneficial or even detrimental, given particular job characteristics, says Denison. For example, highly conscientious individuals whose jobs did not demand such levels actually had lower earnings than individuals who were low in conscientiousness and had jobs that demanded high levels. The researchers say that additional studies will be required to understand how individual job experiences, job satisfaction and job performance might affect the association between individual job personality fit and income. The results of the study suggest that achieving the correct personality fit requires a more nuanced approach to assessing both the individual's traits and job-related traits than previously thought. Paying attention to these nuances could have important implications for both employees and employers. From a practical perspective, companies should be interested in these results because they imply that it's really important to invest in solid personality assessment, Denison says. And individuals should care because our findings suggest that if they manage to find jobs that fit their personalities, they can earn more money.